So this exercise is called half leaning banded lies. Now you're gonna get your clients or yourself basically in a half lean position. And what that means, kneeling basically. All right, so hips, knees, ankles, shoulders, hips, everything is in line. Nice neutral position. You've got to stay away from any internal rotation of the hips or external rotation, so keep everything locked in. You're going to retract that shoulder blades back to so the touching, and then from that position, we're going to go up into that Y. Now, before we do that, I want that, that back glute to that left glute one to be fine, so you really want to engage it. Shoulder retracted, get that posterior, posterior delt, upper back activated, and then we're going to drive up. And then slowly lower. As we're pulling, we're inhaling, keep the shoulders attracted. You want to stay away from any internal rotation of the shoulder there. So keep everything attracted, keep good posture. Little two to three seconds hold at the top. Now, what we're going to be hitting here is our lower traps, our serratus anterior. Now, with the resistance, we want to be going light on this one. We want to get full range of motion. So don't be going too thick with the band. Like I've said in previous videos, you're not going too thick and too heavy with the band. We're not going to get very far with the range of motion. So we're not going to be activating and engaging the correct muscles. Take you through a few more reps. Well, this is a light band that I've got, okay? You want to be aiming for about 10 to 12 reps on each side. So we lock ourselves in. Everything's in a neutral position. Core is braced. Glutes are fine, shoulders retracted, upper back's activated. We drive our thumbs up. Inhale, inhale all the way down. So you can see a lot of people just using the momentum, start to collapse. If you finish off doing that, as we're here, slowly lower, start again. Let's wrap the shoulder blades back, engage the glutes, engage the core, get square. Like I said, activating that upper player, posterior chain now. Try this out, three to five sets of this, 10 to 12 reps on each side. Add this in, when it, when add it into your warm ups, or you can add them into your actual strength sessions as a third exercise. Just get a bit more activation, a bit more strength. Hopefully help with shoulder mobility as well. As, as we're working on our posterior chain, we wanna be activating those muscles which are gonna help with shoulder strength as well, as it's all connected, okay? So we want to be activating our upper back as we did here. We also want to be mobilizing our anterior muscles in the front there, shoulders, chest, and that's all going to help with good health and good strength of your shoulders. Try it out.